Hello, welcome back here to Stevenson. My name is Adam Pohl, joined here by Coach Rayleigh. Coach, uh, obviously it's a defeat in the end, but I think that uh, this was a really valuable experience for your young team. You were in a tight game down the stretch, and it was a great fourth quarter comeback. You, I, I think we did some wonderful things today uh, for such a young group. Um, I think the youth is what hurt us in the end. We, we got a little less confident when the pressure was on, um, but we'll grow from that, and, and I think... Um, you know, Ro Rochester was a good team. Mm -hmm. uh, they did some really nice things. Uh, and we can walk away today saying uh, it wasn't like we didn't have the opportunities to score. We had great opportunities to score. We just couldn't put, we just couldn't finish like we wanted to today. Um, we played a lot of people. We played a lot of people today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> pretty much, pretty much the whole lineup, almost. Um, and and it was good to see some young people get out there and and play the, in their first game, or have their first goal. Uh, that's always so exciting and so fun to watch. You guys are up five four late in the second quarter. That was maybe a turning point. Their ability to score late and then have a strong start to the third period. Well. Um, I, I just think that uh, we we do have some down moments and that we have to kind of time out and 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 regroup, mm -hmm. and that's just that's just youth, I, I think. Uh, this team that we're playing is a little more, little bit more experienced, and I, I think um, that showed today. The experience showed today, not the desire, not the not the will to win, not the X's and O's. It was it was purely just a little bit of um, we were a little young to handle some of that pressure. I think, but they'll get better from that. And you got to tell me about uh, Kara Yuruso who's about to join us as well. Kara, is there somebody, have you seen somebody have so much confidence on the free position shot? She has worked harder than any player I think I have ever coached to take her game to the next level. Um, Kara is, is an unbelievable workhorse in every single practice, every single meeting. She watches more film than anybody. She she works harder in the summer. She works harder in the fall in the in the non traditional season. She, um, you know, I, I just don't know how. You know, when we're out there recruiting, we want twelve Kara Yurusos <laughs> because uh, she was a good player when she came. She's going to leave here one of the greatest, if not the greatest, and and her teammates look up to her, and it's just. To, for her to have a game today, there's only one thing on the planet that I wish for, and that's I wish we could have gotten the win so she could celebrate this great performance and the win. We'll get there this season. I told the girls six games, so I don't want them to make me a liar out of me. But <laughs> I, I, I think that every game we make the steps in the right direction to, to do that. But Kara is just unbelievable. I mean, she plays 60 minutes. She plays both ends of the field. That just doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. And... Um, you know, sometimes we call a timeout just to give Kara a rest. Mm -hmm. and, and Isabel, who's, who is a sophomore, yes. who's taking right after Kara. And, and Kara's just such a great uh, captain and great ex player by example of you just don't ever give up. And when, when, the, when it's on the line, give me the ball. Well, Coach Bradley, we yeah. wish you all the best of luck. And good luck as you continue to build towards Thank conference you. play. Thank you very much.